uh, talking about a violin setup. Um, this is how we did it for the Christmas Eve services on the 24th. We had Lindsay Harris playing a violin. I have loaded the Christmas Eve load in how I did the violin on the Christmas Eve service. You can see right there. Um, here's the gain. Uh, the gain is just a little past noon for the violin. And we mic'd it with a 57 um, over top. Um, and uh, here is the EQ that we used for the violin. Um, I'm not gonna say this is gonna work for, uh, for what you're trying to do, but what seemed to help was really just kind of doing a high pass and a low pass, which kind of helped keep the sound from feeding back and picking up a lot of other stuff. Um, yeah, high pass and low pass. So the um, lower stuff here and even um, the higher stuff here without chopping out too much of the highs of the violin, you can kind of see where the frequencies will be hitting. And then I notched a little bit out here. And like I said, we just used a 57. What seemed to work really well was make sure the 57 was pointed away from the PA speakers as much as possible and try to get the 57, you know, again, as close as you can to the violin with them still being able to play it. So there's a, there's a, there's kind of a fine line in there. Obviously you can't get it too close or they're gonna bump into it. Um, but the closer you can get to the violin, the 57 to the violin, um, the better. Uh, so, and then I used um, a couple of different reverbs. Uh, I used, uh, the one down here is my short, and this is uh, my long reverb. Um, we'll go over to the effects page effects home. Uh, so the short is a plate and the long is a chamber delay. And I think if I remember correctly, um, in utility, sorry, I just got a message in utility, the, um, it was, uh, it's Canyon. Where is it? Canyon. Canyon is my long. Yeah. That's my long one. I use Canyon. I loaded that in for Canyon. I'm gonna use that for our vocals as well. A lot, a lot of time on vocals, and I just, I just dropped it into that effect slot, and I didn't mess with it. The board setting, I seem to like it pretty well. And then the short delay, it is a little, it's a, uh, it is um, TJ a vocal plate is my short, and that works really well for. Um, I use that a lot on acoustic guitars, um, the violin, um, and, uh, yeah, acoustic and violin seems to really, seems to work really well. And again, I just loaded that into one of the effects slots as well. So I just went to the utility button where I am now under utilities under effects and I just hit, uh, load and loaded it in and then just added it on. Um, but I use TJ vocal play a lot on acoustic guitar, like that's it. And it works really well. But the violin, I used the voc this TJ vocal plate, and um, the one is called Canyon. It's at the top. Uh, Canyon, Canyon, Canyon. That one. That one right there. And uh, go to effects. Uh, hit utility again. So you just go to effects, hit utility, and it'll take you to all these presets. And you can just load. So you got to pick the one. So right now I'm on this one right here. So if I went into utility and hit load that one, it would load that effect into that slot right there, which corresponds to 13, 14, 15, 16. I mean 13, 14, 15, 16. Sorry, 13, 14, 15, 16. It corresponds to 13, 14, 15, 16. I hope that helps and doesn't confuse you more. Let me know if you have any questions. Sorry for the shaky camera. It's just my cell phone.